Hi guys, Maxine here with Tink and I Treasures. Welcome back to my studio. Um, I am starting what I'm going to refer to as a boho journal, at least my interpretation of a boho journal. And what inspired me was this beautiful piece of fabric that I had that had the little danglies on it. You can see those. <laughs> so that's what inspired uh, Boho. <laughs> so right now I've, I've got it all stitched around. And on the inside is some wonderfully crackly, um, <clears throat> I want to say it was probably uh, a ma mailer envelope, but it just has this wonderful crackly feel. And um, it, the, mater the material is, it's soft, of course, but not wobbly soft <laughs> um, so it has a pretty good body to it so yeah I've got that all ready to go all sewn around and so now I'm um, choosing papers for it um, I got this kit it was called a boho um, digital kit so I, I kind of liked the pictures of the girls. Um, I don't know. To me, that looks more gypsy, but, you know, we'll go with it. <laughs> anyway, so I have the digital kit, and now I want to choose some other papers. Oh, my goodness. See, I have a really small space, <laughs> so bear with me here. I'm sure when I open this up, I'm going to block that light. Okay, so I have a book here of, I mean, a, a box of some papers, coffee dyed papers. old music books are falling apart. So, that would be fun, wouldn't it? Got one of those. I don't know if you'd like to see this process or not. Um, with picking out picking out things to put in a journal. This is an old Boy's Life magazine. I think I got it in a bundle of things. I still haven't found a use for it. <laughs> One of these days it might just find itself in the recycling. Let's see. What is this? Oh, foreign language. I always like those. There's another one. I don't know what language that is, but we'll go with it. Oh, I don't want any of those. And and we want our just plain coffee dyed writing papers. I like to have a good amount of oh, that one's torn, so that's gonna have to go in collage drawer. <laughs> um, I like having you know a good amount of just plain pages for writing. Oh, look at that. Looks like I was trying something. I'm not sure what I used there, but that's interesting. Okay, what else do we have? Anything? 
got music pages. We got book pages. Journal, so I don't think ledger pages would be, you know, appropriate for this journal. have some of our straw dyed I mean our straw paper from Italy of course right okay so here we go aren't we oh okay so let's start uh, folding these things and putting that together the signature you probably can't see it but this has some coffee dyed staining on it wonderful crackly <laughs> paper. I love that sound. Okay. This this was done. I had a doily that I just put down on top of it and then sprayed with a spray bottle um, coffee. A coffee mixture. Like here. And, and sprayed it with that doily on top of it. And I got that little design up, which was that was fun. Okay, so we got our paper, news, newspaper or something. I'm not sure. It might be from Italy. I I think I think Rachel with Roxy Creations sent me a, a bunch of um papers and stuff so of course that would would be Italian well maybe 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 not you know I mean over there in Italy they have great access to you know all kinds of foreign language things you know and let's face it they have a lot more access to old things as well you know yeah, that has some sparkly dots on it. I don't know what I was doing. I probably should write this stuff down, shouldn't I? <laughs> I start just willy-nilly. Oh, what will this do? What will that do? Hope everyone's doing well, having a good week. Lots of interesting um, projects you're working on. And my favorite thing is um, I download um, audiobooks from the library and I listen to those. And um, just make like clusters, you know, go through my scraps and make clusters or make you know other ephemera and just just relax and just you know go to your happy place <laughs> that's that's my favorite thing to do we all need a happy place these days don't we 
I sure do. Uh, well, I guess I don't know about leaving this. What do you think about leaving this? I know some people do, and but I I don't know. I don't know. I think that might be a little bit too ratty for me. <laughs> I'm not sure about that. Okay, so this paper is longer than our normal papers because well, I think it's like an A4 or something like that from Europe. So what I like to do, instead of cutting it off and wasting it, I like to fold fold one side so then you have a little tuck place on the page and then just fold it like this now this is a little bit narrower but that's good that's okay um, at least I'm not cutting up my straw paper <laughs> I don't know that uh. I don't know about these little papers. I mean, if the lines were going the right way, it would make more sense to me. I know people put those in journals, though. And uh, let me know what you think. I mean, do you like little pa papers like that in a, in a journal? And what do you do? You know, is there anything specific you do with them? Or... I don't know. I guess we could we can make a little pocket and put on there. And then this inside, that's blank, so that could be good writing writing spot, but this side, you know, we could um, put a tuck place or a pocket or something like that in it. So, oops. Did I looks like I didn't Hold right here. Hang on. Oh. It looks all right there. Well, I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's this one. Sometimes paper do, does what you want it to, and other times it just will not. Well, there's one answer for a wayward piece of paper. <laughs> there we go. Okay. We've got our papers. Oops. Um, oh. How about a doily? Coffee dyed, but I kind of gotta remember this is a boho journal, so I don't know. Well, we wouldn't want that, would we? <laughs> Those kind of got used for stuff. Oh, look at that. Well, we're gonna go with that, okay? It's a boho journal, and you know the. Covers kind of reddish, so okay. So we got our papers, this kind over here, and then we have our digital kit. Those two I wanted together. And then these I wanted together. Not so pretty. Oh, yeah. 
Okay, so those are going to be together. I don't know. For our... Maybe this one for our front page, huh? Yeah, let's go with this one for the front page. And then I've got some here that are just... Uh, just background type plain. So those will be our decorating pages. Okay. So let's go with this for our front page. And writing. Music page. straw paper, writing, um, digital, um, go with that brown paper. Go with one of these little guys. Um, writing paper. I don't know if we want to do one or two signatures. No. I usually have more pages in my journals or in my signatures than um, other creators have. That's good. Let's see. I've got one of those. Um, let's go with one of these. Okay, let's do another straw page. And another digital kit. Writing paper. paper and we want to um, I guess we'll have this one as the middle one huh that's pretty we'll have that for the middle um, here's another foreign language paper <laughs> let's see what do we got here? writing writing Okay, so another page from the digital kit. Oh, and that's perfect for the straw paper. Um, writing paper. Oh, now we got a bunch of writing papers. Now, that, yeah, that's the middle. Okay. So that writing 
and then this is the middle. Okay, so let's see if we need to uh, break up some things, or is this a good good placement of all these papers? I don't know. It looks pretty good. What do you think? Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. So, there is the starting of a journal. And that's kind of how you pull pages together, depending on, you know, what you have in your stash. It might be all digital kit with maybe some copy dyed, you know, just plain um, copy paper that's been copy dyed and a digital kit. And that's all you need, really. You know, if you have book pages or foreign language things, straw paper, you know, things like that, it, you know, it's nice to have, but it's not necessary. can make a beautiful journal without all those extra things for sure okay so that is the beginning of a journal and I will see you next time until then take care of you love each other and I'll see you again, and we'll continue decorating this journal. Bye.